Clint Eastwood's Jura No. 2 features a star-studded cast that brings its courtroom drama to life. Jura No. 2's trailer sees Justin Kemp, a man devoted to his family, selected to be a juror in a highly publicized murder trial. The defendant in the trial, James Scythe, is accused of murdering his former girlfriend, Kendall Carter, a year earlier. Justin is faced with a difficult moral dilemma when he realizes that he may have accidentally killed Kendall during a drunk driving incident, and must decide whether to divulge this information while sitting on the jury. Nicholas Holt and Tony Collette were among the first stars whose involvement was announced in Eastwood's latest movie. This marks their reunion 22 years after they played mother and son in 2002's About a Boy. J.K. Simmons, Kiefer Sutherland, Gabriel Basso, and Zoe Duch joined the Jura No. 2 cast as well and are all playing prominent roles in the story. Eastwood is both the director and a producer for the story written by Jonathan Abrams and performed by the impressive cast. Nicholas Holt as Justin Kemp. Date of birth, December 7, 1989. Active since 1996. Actor, Nicholas Holt was born in Wokingham, Berkshire, England. His breakthrough role was as the socially awkward child Marcus Brewer in 2002's About a Boy, a well-received comedy drama. Holt continued to receive more recognition by playing Tony Stoneham in a season of Skins and as a young Hank McCoy beast in X-Men, First Class. He reprised the mutant role in X-Men, Days of Future Past, X-Men, Apocalypse, and Dark Phoenix. Other notable roles include a zombie in the romantic comedy Warm Bodies, Peter Three in the Hulu series The Great, and Tyler in the menu character. Holt plays Justin Kemp, the titular juror in Juror No. 2. Justin cares deeply about his pregnant wife, ally, and their growing family. He is haunted by the night when he was drunkenly driving and hit something. Since he did not see anything when he got out of his car, he assumed he had hit a deer that had run away. As he learns more about the Kendall Carter case, he begins to suspect that he may have accidentally hit and killed her, and must decide what to do with this information. J.K. Simmons as Harold. Date of birth, January 9, 1955. Active since 1986. Actor, J.K. Simmons was born in Gross Point, Michigan, and began to gain more recognition in Law and Order and in Ounce. His most iconic role came as J. Jonah Jameson in 2002 Spider-Man, a role he continued to play in the Sam Raimi-directed sequels and the Marvel Cinematic Universe. His superhero universe footprint expanded further by playing Commissioner James Gordon in Justice League and Zack Snyder's Justice League, along with voicing Omniman Nolan Grayson in Prime Video's Invincible. Simmons also won an Academy Award for his critically acclaimed performance in Whiplash. Notable movies and TV shows character, in Juror No. 2, Simmons plays Harold, one of the jurors, and a man determined to learn the truth about what happened to Kendall Carter, and ensure that justice is served. He travels to the location where her body was discovered and asks the prosecutor whether any other suspects were ever considered or investigated other than James Scythe. Harold does not want to see an innocent man be found guilty of a murder that he did not commit. Tony Collette. Date of birth, November 1, 1972. Active since 1990. Actor, Tony Collette was born in Sydney, Australia, and her breakout role was in 1994's Muriel's Wedding as Muriel Heslop. In subsequent years, Collette starred in several Academy Award-nominated movies, including The Sixth Sense, which also earned her a Best Supporting Actress nomination, along with roles in About a Boy and Little Miss Sunshine. She more recently made her mark on the horror genre with her starring role in A24's Hereditary. Colette was also part of the ensemble cast in Rianne Johnson's first Knives Out movie character, Colette plays the prosecutor in the Kendall Carter case in Jura No. 2. She is trying to prove that James Scythe is guilty in the case of Kendall's death, intent on showing the jury that he killed her after a fight they had at a bar. What she does not know is that one of the jurors, Justin, was present in the same bar that night and that he may be the one who actually killed Kendall. This information threatens to upend her case completely. Kiefer Sutherland as Larry Lasker. Date of birth, December 21, 1966. Active since 1983. Actor, Kiefer Sutherland was born in London, England. The 1986 adaptation of Stephen King's Stand By Me served as his breakout role, with Sutherland playing John Ace Merrill. He had important supporting roles in the 1990s movies A Few Good Men and A Time to Kill. Sutherland is now best known for playing action hero Jack Bauer in the popular television series 24. He also played Thomas Kirkman in Designated Survivor, who unexpectedly becomes the President of the United States after a devastating terrorist attack character. Sutherland's juror number two character is Larry Lasker. Larry is Justin's Alcoholics Anonymous sponsor and someone he trusts. 
Larry is the first person Justin confides in about having potentially killed Kendall Carter. He is initially shocked when Justin shares this revelation with him and later takes a strong stance on the situation, telling Justin, you know what you have to do. As someone trying to help Justin be the best version of himself, he will likely encourage him to tell the truth. Gabriel Barso as James Scythe. Date of birth, December 11, 1994. Active since 2007. Actor, Gabriel Barso was born in St. Louis, Missouri. Barso's breakout roles were in the Big C television series and in J.J. Abrams' 2011 movie Super 8, the former of which saw Barso as a main cast member throughout all four seasons. He starred alongside Amy Adams and Glenn Close in Ron Howard's 2020 adaptation of Hillbill Elegy, which saw Barso playing Vance. Barso is now best known for his starring role as FBI agent Peter Sutherland in Netflix's hit series The Night Agent.